The Manuscript of Survival, Part 326. Solstice Message. June 20, 2013. As you are perhaps aware of, tomorrow June 21, is another pivotal day for your planet. For once again the Sun will make another announcement in her perpetual journey around your globe. Or rather, it is not the Sun, but your planet who will reach an apex of her yearly travels around your shining sister, and as such, you will reach what is referred to as the summer solstice in the northern hemisphere. And then, you will all be able to savor the longest day of the year, before the balance starts to tip the other way, and the days will once again start to shorten. Of course, for those of you living on the opposite end of this beautiful planet, you will be able to savor the thought that it is your turn to look forward to the lengthening of the days from then on. And why do you mention this in length? Because dear ones, tomorrow is also a day that energetically has been marked off in your calendars. Again, this will serve as a focal point for so many, and even if the date in itself does not carry much significance, the very fact that the sun is playing a major part in all of your minds tomorrow will also serve to open you all up to the benevolent energies that will flow down on you all on that day. For the solstice has always been considered as a major power node for humanity all the way back to the very first things, as the subtleties of the changing light have always signaled to the human body. So we ask you all to be aware of this outside influence tomorrow, perhaps a little bit more than usual. You have spent the last period very much by going within and connecting with your center, so tomorrow we ask you all to make sure not to forget to connect without. In other words, as you sit down in silence in whatever mode you choose, Make sure that you do open up to the magnificence that surrounds you on all sides in the form of this energetic grid that is pulsing with life as it holds you safely in its embrace. And as tomorrow is such a powerful part of your ingrained consciousness, it will be utilized to expand this connection even further. So again we say, make sure that you take time to celebrate your efforts by sitting down and opening up for these celestial blessings that will rain down on you all on the day of the solstice a day of celebration and ceremony all over your globe. We know you will all feel how you are a part of something that not only spans your globe, but that is intricately linked much further afield, even further than your shining sister, the Great Sun. So thank her, and thank yourselves, and thank all of creation, as you are all an intrinsic part of this wonderful web of life that suffuses every part of you and everything that you see around you. We thank you all for what you bring to this grid, and tomorrow, we want you all to open up to the gifts that will be given through the benevolent rays of your friendly neighbor, the sun. The Constant Companions Channeled by Asia North Asianorth.wordpress.com